Ever wonder why Europe boasts such diverse landscapes in such a compact space? Well, it's all down to its geographical features. Europe, though small in size, packs a punch with its varied topography. From the rolling hills of the Scottish Highlands to the sun-kissed beaches of the Mediterranean, the continent is a smorgasbord of natural beauty. Europe's geography isn't just about beauty, it's also about variety. You can find towering mountain ranges like the Alps, vast plains in Eastern Europe, and winding rivers such as the Danube and Rhine. Each of these features plays a significant role in shaping the climate, lifestyle, and even the history of the regions they traverse. The geographical diversity within Europe is astounding. It's a continent where you can experience the midnight sun in Scandinavia, harsh winters in Russia, and balmy climates in Spain, all within a day's journey. In essence, Europe is a rich tapestry of geographical wonders waiting to be explored. How did Europe evolve from ancient civilizations to the modern powerhouse it is today? To answer that, let's delve deep into the annals of time. Our journey begins with the ancient Greeks, whose intellectual and artistic prowess laid the groundwork for Western civilization. Fast forward a few centuries, and we find ourselves in the heart of the Roman Empire, a veritable powerhouse that forever etched its mark on the continent. Then, the Middle Ages arrived, a complex period of feudalism, chivalry, and religious fervor. The Renaissance followed, an era of breathtaking art, scientific discovery, and cultural rebirth. The Industrial Revolution, with its steam engines and factories, propelled Europe into modernity, setting the stage for the political and social upheavals of the 20th century. Two world wars, the fall of the Berlin Wall, the formation of the European Union, each a pivotal moment, each a chapter in Europe's riveting tale. The history of Europe is indeed a fascinating journey of evolution, conflict, and progress. What makes the European Union such a unique political entity? It's a question that takes us on a journey through history, economics, and politics. Born out of the ashes of the Second World War, the European Union was formed with the noble aim of preventing another devastating war in Europe. It started as a simple coal and steel community, and transformed into a union of 27 nations working together for a common cause. The European Union has since become a powerhouse, influencing not just the lives of Europeans but also shaping global politics, economics and social norms. It is a beacon of democracy, human rights and rule of law. Economically it's a colossal market that promotes free trade, while politically it strives for peace, security and justice. The European Union, at its core, is a social project too, preserving cultural diversity while promoting social inclusion and cohesion. The European Union in essence is a testament to Europe's quest for unity and diversity. Scene Script Have you ever wondered about the diversity of cultures and languages in Europe? Think of Europe as a magnificent tapestry. Each thread represents a unique culture, language and tradition, all woven together to create a grand picture of diversity. From the melodious Italian language rich in emotion and history, to the complex grammar of Finnish, Europe is a linguistic treasure trove. There are over 200 languages spoken across the continent, each contributing to the rich symphony of voices. Culturally, Europe is just as diverse. Spanish flamenco, Irish folk music, French haute couture, Italian opera and Greek philosophy are just a few examples of the cultural marvels that originated in Europe. Each country, each region has its own unique cultural identity, yet they all come together to form the vibrant and multifaceted European experience. The cultural and linguistic diversity of Europe truly makes it a mosaic of fascinating experiences. What makes European architecture and art stand out on the global stage? Well, it's the sheer diversity and ingenuity that truly sets Europe apart. Each corner of the continent boasts architectural marvels and artistic achievements that span centuries, from the ancient to the contemporary. Europe's architectural landscape is a testament to its cultural evolution. Picture the ancient Roman Colosseum, standing tall in its timeless grandeur. Now, juxtapose that with the modern marvel of the Guggenheim Museum in Bilbao, a symbol of the avant-garde. Art too tells a similar story. The Italian Renaissance paintings, French Impressionist works, and German Bauhaus designs all highlight the continent's changing perspectives and values over time. These structures and artworks are not just aesthetic wonders, they are narratives etched in stone and painted on canvas. They offer insights into the continent's past, its triumphs, its trials, and its transformations. From ancient ruins to modern skyscrapers, Europe's architecture and art form a visual chronicle of its rich history. How have monarchies shaped Europe's past and present? Now that's a question worth pondering. 
For centuries, monarchies were the backbone of Europe. Kings and queens, princes and princesses, they've all played their parts in the grand theater of history. Let's take a brief journey back in time. From the medieval castles of England to the opulent palaces of France, monarchies have etched their mark on every corner of the continent. These royal dynasties were not just figureheads. They wielded significant power, influencing everything from territorial disputes to religious reforms. They've been patrons of arts, arbiters of justice, and strategists in warfare. Today, while many monarchies have transitioned into constitutional roles, their historical significance is no less. In countries like the United Kingdom, Spain and the Netherlands, monarchs continue to represent national unity and continuity. They are living links to the past, embodying centuries of traditions and histories. The legacy of European monarchies continues to influence the continent's political, social and cultural landscapes. What makes European cuisine so diverse and delectable? Ah, the gastronomic delights of Europe. Each country, each region has a unique culinary tradition that reflects its history, culture, and the local environment. Take Italy, for example. Its cuisine is renowned worldwide for its rich pasta dishes using simple, fresh ingredients to create meals that are both hearty and flavorful. Then we have France, a country synonymous with sophistication in the culinary world. Who can resist the allure of a buttery croissant or a delicate macaron? French pastries are a testament to the country's love for the art of baking, a craft honed over centuries. From the hearty stews of Eastern Europe to the seafood dishes of the Mediterranean, every meal is a journey through the tastes and textures unique to each region. It's more than just food, it's a reflection of the cultural diversity and intricate histories that make up the European continent. In essence, European cuisine is a delightful exploration of the continent's cultural diversity. What makes Europe a top destination for travelers worldwide? It's a question that begs an answer as vast and varied as the continent itself. Europe is a patchwork of experiences, a conglomerate of sights and sounds that can whisk you from the lauded vineyards of France to the sun-drenched beaches of Greece in a heartbeat. It's the culture-soaked streets of Spain, the cobblestone charm of Italy, and the fairy tale castles of Germany. Each corner of Europe offers a unique blend of history and modernity, where ancient ruins coexist with bustling cityscapes. It's a place where every city tells a story, every landscape paints a picture, and every tradition dances to the rhythm of centuries-old heritage. From the awe-inspiring northern lights in Scandinavia to the architectural wonders of the United Kingdom, Europe is a treasure trove of experiences waiting to be discovered. Europe, with its rich history, diverse cultures and stunning landscapes, is indeed a traveler's paradise. How has immigration shaped the social and cultural fabric of Europe? It's a question that opens up a complex tapestry, woven with threads of human stories, journeys, and experiences. Migration patterns in Europe are as diverse as the continent itself, influenced by factors such as economic opportunities, political stability, and recent refugee crises. These movements of people have not only altered the demographic landscape of Europe but have also imbued it with a rich cultural diversity. Challenges have arisen of course, integration, housing, employment, these are just a few of the hurdles both immigrants and host countries grapple with. Yet these challenges are often counterbalanced by the opportunities migration brings. New skills, perspectives and cultural exchanges contribute to the dynamism of Europe. The influence of immigration is etched deeply into Europe's social and cultural fabric. It has shaped traditions, sparked innovation, and fostered a sense of shared humanity. Immigration in many ways has added new dimensions to the diverse fabric of Europe. How is Europe addressing the pressing environmental challenges of our time? Europe is no stranger to the escalating threats of climate change, and it is responding with urgency and determination. Across the continent, nations are stepping up their conservation efforts, preserving their rich biodiversity, and enhancing their natural landscapes. From the highlands of Scotland to the vineyards of Italy, Reforestation initiatives are taking root. In the bustling cities, green architecture is reshaping skylines, while renewable energy sources are reducing carbon footprints. Europe's commitment to sustainability is also reflected in its policies, such as the European Union's ambitious Green Deal, aiming to make the continent climate neutral by the middle of this century. Moreover, Europeans are fostering a culture of sustainability, embracing eco-friendly practices in their daily lives, from recycling to cycling. This collective action is a testament to Europe's resolve to safeguard our planet for future generations. As Europe grapples with environmental challenges, 
it continues to strive for a sustainable and resilient future.